Welcome back guys after a while, first tutorial of 2019 and today I'm bringing you Adobe After Effects tutorial Three template that you can use for your project, color title, motion graphics So without any further ado, let's jump right into it Alright guys, so currently we're in the Premiere Pro just because afterwards we're gonna add sound effects, music, stuff like that Once you've selected your clip, you're gonna press right click and then select replace with after effects composition and we basically wait a second unless you have a very quick computer i can't complain mine is pretty quick all right guys so now you have to name your file of course let's say 2019 call out titles tutorial of course there's no colored titles you might be thinking Where's the color? Hold on, we're gonna get to it. Press tracker, then track motion. Select this tracker point, make it slightly big, bigger because it will have to guide your black dark point. So you press play and it's basically tracking it for you. As you can see, it's very straightforward and you don't actually have to do anything. It's tracking it for you. I really love this feature. I mean, if I had to do it frame by frame, it would take me forever. All right guys, so once you tracked uh, the entire kind of footage that you are happy with, now what you're gonna do is right click on this space, create new, no object. In the track corner, edit the target, set it to no, okay, and apply. Boom. Now we have this red looking corner that is located near uh, my hand. And that is perfectly fine because you won't be able to actually see it on the final footage. I did this circle especially so that it would be easier for the program to track it, but obviously you can track your fingers, but sometimes the program might pick up different fingers and you might get like glitches and stuff like that. So it's always better to have a contrasting object that you're trying to track. So now on the left hand side, you press the right mouse click and you press import file now you search for the callout title in your downloads folder and you open the project the template you open the folder and you select callout title this is basically the project that you have just downloaded the free template that you as my subscriber are available to do so as you can see now we have that ready we kind of want to do is go to that layer press g and put it a little bit somewhere here. And this is the most crucial. Now you get this color title, you press pre-comp2 and go to the text, command T and you're able to change the name of the text. So of course, for the sake of the tutorial, I'm gonna name it hand. What would it be else? Maybe say cool hand. Let's go back to the color title. As you can see, it looks kind of right. So once we have that ready, basically drop the color title here, bring it to the front. Here's the cool part. We want this point to be on our hand. So of course we need to move it and of course make it slightly bigger uh, and then move it to the right. And then you need to click here and hold it and we're gonna parent it to the null object, which is essential in this tutorial. It's perfectly tracked. You can't actually see the cool hand just because it is blue. So we're gonna make it, I'm not gonna say that word, but we're gonna change the color. Let's choose the bright color. So now you can see it works pretty fine. Cool hand, one essential thing. If you want to make this effect really, really look good, toggle switches or if you're in this mode it's perfectly fine motion blur that's what we're gonna use as you can see there's so much motion blur on my hand you can't really even see it properly not to mention the circle but if you want the cool hand to be blurred as well all you got to do is click here and then here and as you can see guys this is such an important effect footage is gonna look so much better so now as you can see there's this motion blur on the cool hand and it's going everywhere it looks pretty decent i would say all right guys so as you can see this is our final effect 
hope you like it i hope it was useful remember you can download the preset uh, the template in the description below for after effects it's not that hard as you imagine it's quite easy to learn as you can see i'm not a professional editor or anything like that but i can manage it so i bet you can manage it as well if i could you would probably manage it as well but as you can see really cool effect you can download it in the description below and that's pretty much it for today's tutorial I hope it was useful, the entire template is for you to use, of course it would be great if you could uh, credit me if you use it in some of your videos, of course if that doesn't happen I'm not gonna chase you down, of course. I will find you. Slide into my DMs on Instagram, send me um, where you've used it in your productions, I, I would love to see uh, how you guys use it creatively. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe to my channel, like the video and you can also give me some suggestions in the comments below which tutorial should i do next what you want to learn i was speaking for way too long today anyway thank you so much for tuning in download the footage in the description below thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video tutorial slash review yeah bye oh if you're still there yeah, definitely subscribe. Subscribe to the channel, not to miss any of those videos.